Hey, y'all. Welcome to my channel. This is Niambi Shali. This message is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, North Node, Venus. Um, heavy placements. Um, I don't know what the title of this video is because I was getting some... Um, some messages in my meditation and I just want to share them with you. Um, if this is your first time here, I'd like you to put a white heart. And let's get on with the reading. Uh, if you are 18 and under, back out. <laughs> if you are 18 and under, back out because I do curse. Um... Man, I couldn't wait to get up here with y'all. I was like, I was feeling you all all day yesterday. And I was like, okay, I'm going to get up today um, and do a read. Uh, one of the things that kept coming through was they just want to argue. And I was like, what does that mean? So, we're going to get to the cards and hopefully, you know, we can uh, figure that out. Um, so. I feel like Libra is so accustomed to helping and, um, and being there for people, all right? it's just like, that's something that we're accustomed to. You know, we expect others to give us that, um, but they don't, or very few do. Um, I just, I, I feel like Libra is the, well, this is, it's just, it is what it is. We're the only we sign in the Zodiac, like, you can go, every, you know, it's I, me, I am. And it's like, we are the only we sign where we are. I'm going to take these and then I'll clarify. I do, I do not to read reversals, as you know. Um, I'm going to go with this one. Okay, so we have the hangman. And with the hangman uh, going with my message that came out intuitively, they just want to argue. It's like, I feel like at this time, we need to take time to sit with ourselves. To, to, to hangman meaning um, just know that whatever you want or whatever is for you is coming in. So instead of arguing with a person or allowing that person to project that onto you, it's best for you to be and and hangman hangs alone. Now this this doesn't mean you have to be alone or this is a, a long time, but you have the hangman is is chilling. Like I know what I want is coming in. I know what what I'm looking for. It will be here. It will come if it's not already here. So, um, six of cups. Six of cups being the gift from the universe. It's like, it's like even if this is a person coming in for you, you know, if there is a situation where you feel like you gotta argue or they wanna argue or it's it's beef. You know, that's the energies of this time. It just is what it is. That's what people are doing. That's how people are handling situations. They're dealing with their own demons. Their inner demons want to attack you. You know, and so Six of Cups just meaning like, chill out. Because... You got something in store. Something that's coming for you. You got to not worry about the people that hate on you. The people that hate you. The people that look sideways at you for no reason. You know. <clears throat> and you you came out in the reading. You came out in the reading. See, 
when people, the thing about Libra and people, it's like people think that Libra is not paying attention because typically we don't care. You know, typically Libra does not care. Um, it's no secret. I'm a Libra. Um, and typically it's not that we're not paying attention, especially if it's not our partner. It's like Libra, uh, not, like I said, not that Libra is not paying attention. It's that Libra don't care that much about that information. And it's almost like sometimes we don't care until it's too late. And that's okay because Libra has to take time away to care for self. Libra has to take time away. It, it's, it's simple. The unevolved Libra doesn't understand that. But Libra has to take time for Libra. Oh, this is this is such the energy that's coming in right now. It's like just be patient. Just be patient. I gotta put this down. Just be patient. Hangman and Temperance. I'm like, <sighs> fourteen for Temperance is is more like, um, a five. Um, could be an inner conflict, but this is about. But Temperance is about being patient. Hangman is there is a change, but I'm going to chill out till it comes. So it's like this, this is reminiscent of like, like I see looking at these cards, I, I see someone else in the situation and I don't know where it is, but you could be tricking yourself about that person. It can be some things you don't know, some things that's going on that you're trying you're trying to figure out, you're wondering about. You you're underwater, you're trying to figure it out. You're not seeing it, but in this picture, it's like the moon that those secrets, those those things is channeling to you. So be in that be in that mode of receiving whatever information is coming to you receive it six of cups like understand it this is a this is a victory at heart that's a victory at heart so it's like you know no matter what justice is here for you people don't understand justice is not about knowing what's right it's about knowing both sides you know, so a lot of times Libra can play between both um, both worlds because we have, overall for Libra, it's like God's spirit source is always trying to get you by yourself. And, and, it, and it's uncomfortable because Libra, Libras are not um, by themselves people. They're always trying to help somebody. They're accustomed to helping. They've been helping since they were a, a child. You know, like I said, we're the only we sign. We are set to help. We are here to help. We earth angel energy. We're bringing justice to any situation. We're not going to allow people to do anything to us or other people. Like if we see it, we got to say something. But the thing is, God's spirit source is always trying to get you to self so you don't trick yourself. And so nobody else tricks you. Or tries to trick you because I I say it all the time. You can't trick Libra. Libra tricks Libra. But yeah, I'm just like um. Oh, so they just want to argue. Who we talking about? Come on, cause right now it's so you. This is this is all you. This is nobody else is in this. <laughs> Nobody, I'm not seeing anybody else in this. And and the thing is, if somebody else is in this, it'll come out. So let's just, uh, Spirit, give me clear messages for Libra. Uh, I, um, 
I'll vote for highest lights of the universe to come in right now. Give me some messages for Libra. Clear messages for Libra. Pretty please. Pretty please. I'm going to take those. Five of Swords. And, and this right here is almost like this, that other person. Whether it's, is it a relationship? Because I don't see none, of, I don't see any conflict in these cards. And so this is like, like I said, a person who's dealing with, when we're talking about source, we're talking about thoughts. So I feel like it's a person that's dealing with their own thoughts. The inner demons are trying to attack you. That person wants your light, is seeking your light, wants to come in and snatch your light in any kind of way. So I will pester you. I will complain to you. I will hurt your feelings. I will, you know, you, like right now, I just feel like people who are not completely awoke, oh, awakened, people who are not um, even on their their route to trying to figure out what's going on, um, they're just vessels. They're just vessels. And I feel like they are controlled or maintained by another power source. You know, because if you look at this card, like right here, it's like this person, they, they're they dealing with their own thoughts. And the thing is, they think they have a victory over you. You see that person back there? It's like they think that they have a victory over you. So let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. Um, I'm going to put some information um, in the description. So if you want a personal reading from me, we can um, connect. But this is Libra Collective. And so it gets more, it gets better detail with questions. And so um, I'm going to, if I don't do it this time, I'm going to eventually put um information in the description where I can be reached and we can, you know, link or whatever. But um, I just wanted to, you know, this is the world. It's the world. You have the ability get closer to God's spirit source. Get closer to the divine. Because anything that you want, anything that you're thinking about, anything that you put your feet on, anywhere that you step, you can have. And, and Libras know that. Like, we almost know that. We manifest so quickly. So it's like, don't let a person, uh, when I see a, the spread like this, everything is individual. And then this comes in, like, like I said, just want to argue, just fighting their own demons. Just trying to figure out what it is going on in their world. And they will do and use and manipulate and have a Libra thinking a certain way because we want to know, like, it, is it me? Is it my fault? Did I do something? No. You ain't doing shit. Oh, and I'm taking all of them. Six of Pentacles. Like, victorious in money. M major, major movement. I said this. I've said this with this energy that's here. This Leo new moon. This is movement. This is heavy, heavy movement. Money coming in. No, without a doubt. Money moving around. But if you split your energy, you cannot split your energy. And that's what I try to tell people all the time. You cannot split your energy. I mean, split your energy so simple as, okay, I'm cool. And then somebody hit your line. You call them back and they don't answer. So now your energy is split between like, man, um, what is it that I did? What, what did I do? Uh, what happened? No, no splitting of energy. Nine of Swords. This is what I mean. This is a person. This is, and, and when I say this, understand what I'm saying is, it's the deception. It's the deceiving. 
I ain't did shit. So people, like I said, are, are like vessels, like just walking around, not even, not wanting to wake up and not woke while you are constantly looking for answers. You constantly looking for answers. Don't let nobody put you here. If you are here, do everything that you can to get up out of there because the money is moving. The money is moving. The love is moving. The, the stability is moving. Everything is in, a he and is in heavy movement right now. What I mean by that, new moon and Leo, is so many things right now changing in the planetary alignment that, yeah, you do not have to worry about anything. It's First of all, Libra is always talking to the divine. Libra is always, Libra walking around all day talking to God, spirit, source, because Constantly trying to figure out, looking for answers. What is the answer? What is the key? What, what? Knowing we justice, we doing, we gonna do the right, even when we don't do the right thing, God's spirit source got us. So please don't, don't set out to, you know, I, and I'm now, I'm like, okay, what? Because it's so many Good cards. I'm like, mm -mm, I'm gonna clarify with this one, and I shuffle these. So I'm gonna just clarify for me. Oh, watch your energy. What's on? What's out? What's it? What? What is this? What's this for me? And I want to take that one, but get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. Out of these paper thin ass cards, I'm mad at this deck too. I am mad at this deck, but I. I'm looking for a right away clarified deck, and this was that this was what they had. So I'm like, meh. <laughs> but yeah, get the fuck out of here. You know what the fuck this is? Ace of Cups. Keep your emotions in check. If your emotions is not in check. Get them in check. Let me give you some um some practices. If your emotions are not in check, if your mo emotions are all in the air, I'm seeing Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy, and um get your emotions in check. And I'm gonna tell you like some practices to get your emotions in check. It's it's a first of all. Get to spirit every day. Cups is always a gift. We make it. We can turn it into, you know. Get to spirit, God, spirit, source every day. I'm going to tell you. how to pray. Ask God's spirit source to get your emotions in check. Ask for God's spirit source to take away any type of discord you have, any type of turmoil. Because this is what God's spirit source has for you. I always want you to have your heart, mind, and soul in a in a, in a in a higher realm. 
<sighs> and when I when I look at this spread, like everything is good. I I see one person. I'm sorry. With the tricks, the th the thievery, the 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 hit. And if this is not somebody else, this is you. You're tricking yourself. Might be some things you got to work on. Understand if it's static, I told you your spirit is, and, I, and if I haven't said it to you all today, your spirit is how you feel. So if you aggravated, if you can't, if you're not understanding, if you feel like you in the dark, th then you got to do the work. And doing the work just means getting to God's spirit source every day. Get into God, spirit, source every day. And this makes me want to use this deck because um, this is in a wisdom. Like I said, it's so many people that just want your light. They want to play the victim. They want to act like, oh, uh, people do this to me. People do that to me. Nah, motherfucker. Uh-uh. Ain't nobody doing nothing to you. Oh, I went through this in childhood. Nope. Nope. We, we're not talking about that type of shit. Um, now, you talking about something that happened to you when you was 10 years old? Uh-uh. I got over mine. You got to get over yours. Because we, we try so hard. And we do. We attach ourselves to other people. And I want it too, so I can get it. I don't want to. I'm gonna shuffle it up because I don't want to um, shuffle right. Okay. Now this is my new deck. That's a brilliance, and that's that's like I said. <laughs> Sorry, baby, but Libra is brilliant. Okay. Libra is the diamond. Libra is the gift. Any motherfucker in your face trying to tell you that you're not, that's them. And I'm going to have to read the book on this. Merkaba. Let us get the book out. That's my first time getting that one. Bear with me, bear with me. I never, I, well, actually, I've seen it. I just never pulled it before. Merkaba, light, spirit, body. The connection point of the self. You are a vortex of brilliant light, love that is currently manifested in the human body. This does not limit you to only linear physical experiences on the earth plane. However, you can awaken different dimensions of the self and travel in your interdimensional field of light through transcend, oh, Transcendental meditation. I look okay. I don't want to get too deep into meditation with y'all, but when I say I love to meditate, it was something that I learned. I'm straight from the hood and I learned how to meditate, I learned how to invoke the spirit. But I'm gonna study this card, but this is all about connectivity lower and higher polarity and like i said we we libra has to be able to go between light and dark because we are justice it's just that simple we are justice we are put here to show people the right way and a lot of times when we get in those situations where, you know, we had to hurt somebody or we had to piss them off or we had to walk our way or go our way. Because a lot of times 
a person has to do so much to Libra in order for Libra to say, you know what, motherfuck you. So that's why I'm trying to explain is that even if you didn't do dark things in your life, you had to you experienced darkness in your childhood. Like and so then you chose and you told yourself, no, nope, no more of that. You know, but at some point, Libra always gets to a spiritual point in life. And I'm just a firm believer in that. It's like, because we we are put here to figure out life. We're put here to figure out life. That's where your that's where your placements are. And it's just that's why I said sun, moon, rising, north node, Venus. If you have heavy placement in Libra, man, it, you were put here for that to figure out what life is. These are the two: brilliance and Merkaba. And I I love it because I'm I'm almost positive this is not the excuse me this is not the only card that talks about meditation in this deck, but. I love meditation. I love connection. Understanding that we are all connected. And this is the reason why I've always felt like helping somebody or being there for somebody or making sure people are okay and, and getting fucked over and then understanding that it's not you. It's them. That's just, they're not a we person. They're not a we person, you know? And so, I hope this read helped you. If it resonated with you, please, please, please leave a comment. Um, I am very, very new to this, but if, like I said, if it resonated with you and it kind of gave you something to, to think about, um, press the like button, leave a comment. If you want a personal let me know if you would like, um, um, like I said, just let me know that it, it hit home, it resonated, you, you kind of felt that, you, even if you didn't feel all of it, you know, um, but I'm looking forward to coming back, so see you next time.